Here we are outside of Lowe's and we're gonna be shopping for smart home tech. I'm a big fan of anything that's electric. So we've got Ego, which is the number one brand for uh, electric lawnmowers. They've got their full lineup here at Lowe's. Uh, very good pricing as well. All right, so most uh, appliances now are gonna be Wi-Fi connected, you know, from your refrigerator to your washer dryer to get notifications. Uh, the Samsung Family Hub really kicks it up a notch. You can do all sorts of things like um, put messages on your, your screen, see what's inside, um, sync your calendar, things like that. Uh, so a really cool refrigerator option from Samsung that's quite pos uh, popular. But uh, Also LG has a really cool lineup as well and they've got all those here in stock at Lowe's. So hidden in the garage door section here, we found uh, the smart garage doors from Craftsman and also from Chamberlain. Uh, what's nice with that is then you can control your garage door from your phone. You can check on it remotely and see if it's left open or closed. So a uh, really cool feature that's pretty much becoming standard on new garage doors. So hidden in the middle of the store, we found this little display that has their smart home stuff. and just these little tickets you take up to the front. We've got Google, ring and more ring stuff on the back side here so nothing really to look at but uh, they do have the products available products it looks like they're offering uh, google whole line right there including the nest cameras doorbell speaker we've got yale lock we've got all of the ring products simply safe which we've tested in the past is a great system uh, for do-it-yourself or if you've got a lot of uh, ring devices already the ring security system is a great option as well. It looks like you just grab one of these sheets and take it up to the front there. I've got the newest generation, fourth gen Echo. I've got, interestingly enough, a Echo Dot, a older generation right below it. Uh, then on the bottom here, we've got, you know, the Nest with the plug, a couple of lighting options. Looks like they've kind of condensed everything here to this aisle. We've got uh, more ring uh, doorbells. When you're looking at ring doorbells, I always recommend going with the Pro Series. Uh, that's wired if possible. Uh, but now, of course, they're trying to compete in the lower end price point, so you're going to see uh, more affordable options as well. Uh, but yeah, these, these are all really good options here. And then uh, we randomly have a Nest Protect sheet, so that's something that's going to listen uh, for you know, if your smoke or carbon monoxide alarm goes off and notify you on your phone. Uh, great product there. And looks like we've got just some random uh, replacement wireless doorbells. So. so Lutron is a great option. I highly recommend checking out that starter kit there. And then uh, if you're gonna add more switches, look for this kit that comes with the switch and the Pico and the faceplate all in one. And then if you need any extra brackets, uh, they're there. They've got the fan switch here. It's a great option. Otherwise, just the switch itself. Um, sometimes you're gonna have to go to multiple stores if you're doing your whole house at once, because as you see, there's only you know, three of those in stock. And so if you have more than three switches, you may end up having to go to a couple locations or ordering online, but uh, it's a great option. I don't know where you would put these in their house, but this is freaking awesome. You should probably just buy them. <laughs> All right, so we're in the lighting section. Uh, we saw some fun lights earlier, but now we're into the smart section and we've got C by GE, which is a great brand, something we've covered in the past. They've got their little motion sensors, their control, their plug, their bulbs, which come in both uh, colored and uh, just white dimming. Uh, and then the other brand that they carry here is Fiat. Uh, so they got their Wi-Fi bulbs down there. Um, not exactly the best brand per se, but uh, yeah, it gets the job done. They also got some smart light strips as well, which would be good for like under cabinet type stuff. Um, but not a huge variety of options as far as smart lighting goes. All right, over in the lock section, we found Schlag, which is a very good brand. They've got the Sense and the Schlag Connect. So whether you want your Wi-Fi version or your Z-Wave version, they've got you covered. And then a variety of different looks uh, to complete what you're going for, match your existing hardware. And it looks like we've got it all sorted by brand. So right here, we've got Quick Set, 
uh, very nice Halo Wi-Fi controlled lock. Up here is the 917, the 888. So those are just going to be your electronic touchpad style. Uh, the 909 is a deadbolt version of that same lock. Uh, so we have all those available here. All right, so we're over by appliances and we found this uh, tiny section of thermostats. Uh, very well labeled, of course. Uh, we've got Nest, uh, both versions, the more affordable option and then the original. Uh, Honeywell, great option there, a couple options, and then Ecobee. Uh, so I personally use Ecobee in my house. I recommend the light. I don't feel that you need to pay more for having a voice assistant built in because I assume that you're going to have a lot of other voice assistants around your house and honestly it can be kind of annoying if it picks up uh, your thermostat speaker instead of a different speaker when you're asking it to play music. Uh, so uh, I like just going with the light version and then if you're a Google household of course uh, the Google Nest is a great option then you have everything in one app and a lot of new homes are coming with Honeywell uh, so if you have that included in your house it's a great Wi-Fi connected thermostat and highly recommend it.